than that. So you're saying the Republican Party deserves the nomination? I'm not saying anything. Then why are you talking about the Republican Party? I'm just mentioning the Republican Party because I think they'd have a better chance at implementing reforms rather than the candidate be a Democrat. I disagree. On which part? On, wait, why are we talking about politics? Because you mentioned the high price of steak here, which I find pretty reasonable. $55 for a 12-ounce sirloin seems a bit unreasonable, don't you think? What? Why don't we talk about something else, like your recent award? We already talked about that. Refresh me. Why don't we talk about you for a change? What about me? I don't know. Considering you've had your phone in your left hand for this entire time, I could assume you're busy with something. It's nothing. You're working on something, aren't you? What gives you that assumption? I asked you first. If I'm creating the future. Could you be a little bit more vague? You asked what I was doing, and that is exactly what uh, I'm doing. Are you ready to order? Um, could you give us a couple more minutes, please? Sure, no problem. Thanks. Um, how is um, I'm creating a new internet service. That's cool. What was, what was that? What? You paused in, the, in your last sentence. I was just complimenting you. I understand you that. You clearly don't. Look, I'm sorry. I just don't like when people are fake with me. Oh, so I'm fake now. <laughs> That's not what I meant. Um, <laughs> Chris, I think I'd better go home. You can't. I can't? No, you can't. Oh, watch me. Wait, stop.